Another beautiful day setting up on this Friday. I'm ABC 13 meteorologist Alita Loresca, but some changes are on the way. We will see a little bit more cloud cover as those upper level winds take in a little bit more moisture. Nothing falling from the clouds for this afternoon, but temperatures certainly warming up with that southeast breeze. We get close to hitting 90 degrees in Houston, closer to the coastline in the low 80s. Winnie today, a high of 88, 88 in Katy as well, 89 out toward Hallettsville. Overnight lows will be into the 60s with that southerly breeze should be strong enough to prevent any sort of fog from forming. But if that wind comes in lighter during the morning hours, you may see a little bit of that sea fog cropping up. Nothing widespread. Temperature readings will go from those low to mid 60s into the mid 80s for Saturday afternoon, and then we'll start to transition into more humid conditions. That humidity will be felt on Mother's Day. We'll start off with those morning temperatures only dropping off into the mid 70s. We will once again get close to hitting 90 degrees. You'll notice the rain chances for Mother's Day at 30%, so it won't be a complete washout, but we will need to be on the lookout for a few strong thunderstorms along the I-10 corridor and to the south, even along the upper Texas coastline. That area shaded in yellow, that is a slightly higher risk for seeing some of those thunderstorms turning severe, so will be more scattered in nature for our far northern counties. Sunday morning, we'll be waking up to the muggy conditions. There could be some light to moderate mist building with those winds coming in out of the Gulf, and then some pockets of heavier rain should unfold as we get in toward the latter half of the afternoon into the evening. Some locally heavy rain will be possible overnight Monday or overnight Sunday into Monday morning, but I think some of that heaviest rain will be in our far northern counties. That front is expected to stall, and anytime you have that stalling front, got to be on the lookout for potential for street flooding or any ponding on the roads. So we will definitely be monitoring that for you as we get into early next week. That front that stalls does not clear out until Wednesday. So we've got the threat for rain showers each and every day beginning tomorrow. And then once the front moves through on Wednesday, we will see a drop in the humidity. So by Thursday morning, feeling a little bit better out there with temperatures hovering somewhere into the 60s and highs jumping back into the low 80s. All right, that's a look at your forecast on this Friday. It's Mother's Day weekend, so shout out to all the moms out there. We appreciate you. Thanks for watching.